hey, this is going to be kind of a show and tell blog. Vlog. Whatever. Um, we got this closet cleaned out today in the hall closet. Now Dad's clothes are in here and everything's dusted out. And we got the hall closet cleaned out and now it's actually, there were more of Mom's clothes in there. But now we have the vacuum in there and the sewing machine sitting in the bottom and we have our maps in there and some gift bags that are up on a shelf and that was all done. And um, But I found some things that made me chuckle a little bit and just some pretty things and um, stuff, you know, you know, the little treasures you find when you're cleaning out the closet. Well, in this closet back here, there is a filing cabinet. And I found in there, what was the first thing I found? What would this be? He has divorce papers from his first wife. Her name was Lois. They were only married for like six months. And, and then what's right behind that? Yeah. What could that be? His divorce papers for his second wife, Jordana. They got married, I mean, they got, they got divorced in June of 1971. I was born in May of 1972, and um, so yeah, I was wondering if Mom and Dad had dated towards the end of when he was married, because apparently Dad said that Jordana had left and gone to Florida. I don't know. A whole weird thing there. He's been friends with all of them, so he was only married to her for a year. And then, pow, eight track. Oops, I'm, come on back to me. Come on. Yeah. Why doesn't this thing focus? Is it going to focus? Come on. You can do it. I don't know, but I'm going to go close anyway. 8-track. Captain and Tennille. Oh yeah, you know it. And I found this for Peggy. Peggy, this is a pin. I want to put this with the stuff I'm going to bring you. It's a celestial pin. Isn't it pretty? And, oh! Okay, there it goes. And this is something my neighbor man had made for me when I was a kid. I'm going to put it in the sale in the spring because honestly I don't know where to put it. It is um, a carousel that you wind up and then let it and it goes down and up. Swings back and forth. Yeah. When it's not swinging, you settle it on this so the, the ribbons don't have stress on them. Yeah, I dusted this thing off. That was a trip. And then... I found this little bag. Anybody who wants any of these things in this little bag, tell me. Because I don't know what else to do with them. And they're small. I can set them in a little pot of wood. There are all these wood things. There are two that are not wood. First up is a little piece of wood cut out like a gumball machine. So, gumball machine. A little piece of wood. These are okay. They're all little pieces of wood. Like a Coca Cola machine. Okay. This is a tiny basket of eggs. It's very small. Little tiny petite basket of eggs. I have a little Aunt Jemima type mammy thing. I don't know. This one I can't give away because it's dad's, but Razorback Warthog. Um, this popcorn. Alright, next up, what shall I get out? Milk. Let's see, milk. A tiny, tiny 
bag of, whoops, too close. Let it focus. Are you gonna focus? It's sugar. It isn't gonna focus, but it's sugar. It says five pound sugar. And this is a five pound bag of flour. Tiny butter churn. I have no idea why we had this. Um, that's all the wooden stuff. And then there's two little figurines. One's a bear in a box. And one's a bear in a basket. So anybody who wants any of those, please tell me. Send me your um, information. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven things up here. So come on. Tonight I'm gonna have um, beverage night on Stickham. I'm gonna have the last few Jello shots I had um, from Lizzie left me from South Tube, and I have some pudding shots, and I'm gonna have a little cooler with ice and. I'm just going to have a beverage night. So that'll be fun. And last night, everybody was in there. It was so awesome. Beth finally came in. Yay, Beth. It was awesome. And the king and queen from South Tube were there. You know, we had royalty in our mists. And they're going to have a love child. They are. I heard it with my own ears. Um. So, yeah. I'll be on stick cam tonight. Actually, it's like 5.30 right now. I think I'm going to go lay down and take a little power nap. So I will survive on, on stick cam tonight because I have stayed up past midnight the last three nights in a row, which is unusual for me. Actually, last night, I was up till 4.30. I got off stick cam and I laid in bed and a movie started at 2 and I started to watch it and it didn't get over till 4.30. I just wasted two and a half hours of my life because <laughs> the end of it, I'm like, what the hell? It was called About Smith with Jack Nicholson. Yeah, it wasn't my favorite movie. And I did order a movie on eBay yesterday, an old movie from the 80s that somebody said is their favorite movie. And I got a really good buy on it. It wasn't that expensive. So I'm going to check it out when I get it. To see how I like it. Okay, that's all I got right now. Now it's gonna be go lay down. I have wet hair, so I'll probably look like alfalfa tonight because it'll probably all be sticking up because I just had a shower and dinner. Okay, that was my show and tell edition of my, you know, brain not working right now. Bye.